Hey, good morning, PJ. Yes, welcome po, welcome kay Eric sa PJ's Automotive Service. Again, uh, maraming salamat sa pagpunta po. Okay, uh, may mga katanong lang ako dito, PJ, mm -hmm. about sa uh, car battery. Yes. Ano ba yung uh, CCA? Uh, CCA is basically, ginagamit yung CCA sa mga malalamig na climate countries such as Canada and as you know, uh, it's specifically designed only sa mga malalamig na lugar such as here in Manitoba or Canada in general. So CCA stands for Cold Cranking Amperage. Mm -hmm. So it says there already Cold Cranking Amperage. So it's the ability or the power of the battery to start your motor, your engine, in the very cold weather, which is minus 18 and below. So yung, for example, yours, I think yours is about 550 to 600 CCA. Mm -hmm. So that's how much amperage that this battery can use to start your, uh, your yung makina mo, mm -hmm. yung, yung engine mo. Uh, at, for at least 30 seconds, in the period of 30 seconds, uh, the weather below minus 18. So, mga malalamig na lugar. Now, yung CCA rated is different than CA. Sa Pilipinas, ang ginagamit natin yung CA. So, kung dadali mo itong baterya na ito sa Pilipinas, it's not gonna last because it's not designed in, in a hot right, tropical okay. country. So, they use CA in the Philippines, which is cranking amperage. Okay. Yeah. So, the higher CCA, much better? The higher CCA, the better for your uh, engine uh, to start in a very cold weather. Uh, however, uh, hindi po pwede nalalagyan mo lang siya ng, of course, ng napakalaking CCA numbers. Uh, it has to be specifically designed kung ano lang yung pangangailangan ng makina mo. So, halimbawa, yung makina mo sa Nissan 2007, Nissan Sentra mo, will not be the same to uh, V6 type engine or okay. you know, V8 type engine. So, of course, mas malaki yung makina, mas malaki yung CCA niya. Kasi mas mahirap pa ikutin yung mga malalaking makina. Okay, so there is a sizes. That's correct. It's specifically designed for your motor. So, yeah. bago sila bumili ng battery, like, example, before my uh, Nissan Sentra, the CCA was uh, 450. Yes. And then we change it to 550 CCA. Mm -hmm. So the same yung uh, size niya? The same yung physical size ng yes. bateria, but the power that the battery can produce uh, during the cold weather would be a lot higher than mm -hmm. 450. So yung, yung 450, yun yung tinatawag na cold cranking amperage. Yeah. Uh, it's basically the power, the ability of the battery to rotate your engine in yeah. the very cold weather. Yun yung ginagamit niyang amperage, uh, you know, for the period of 30 seconds. So when you start that in a very cold weather, minus 18 and below, that's how much amperage uh, that your engine is drawing off your battery. Ganun po. Uh, so mabilis siyang magka-crank. That's correct. Mas malakas at mas mabilis. Okay, correct. that's why you need the uh, yeah. higher CCA. Higher CCA in a cold weather. It's only designed in a cold weather. Okay, the higher the amp, the bigger the size. Yes, kasi po mahirap paanda rin o paikutin yung makina ng starter pagka malamig sa labas. Mm -hmm. Kasi ang, ang langis natin is thick. Mm -hmm. You know, if it yeah. sits overnight, if you try to start it in the morning, napaka-thick ng, uh, ano, ng, uh, ng, ng langis. Kaya mas mahirap siyang paikutin ng starter. Kaya you need higher amperage sa CCA. So, so, kung halimbawa ang bibili sila, they need to know they, the size that no, kasi baka magkamali sila na Yes, kabili. so what they need to remember is they need to know yung year, make, and model ng vehicle. Kaya nga, we as a professional, what we do is we take their VIN number, yung identification oh, okay. ng vehicle. So, we would know exactly kung anong klaseng baterial o kung anong size or how high the amperage can be. Yung, yung limit niya when it comes to CCA. So, so pwede ba natin makita kung saan nakalagay yung CCA sa battery? Can that is correct. Yeah, and we're gonna show you guys later uh, once we uh, once we bring that vehicle down uh, from the air. Yeah, okay. We'll be able to show you guys that. 
Okay. And we're also going to be showing you why we test the battery. Okay. So we're going to be showing you that one as well coming up uh, for a reason, for a reason. So basically here's your battery. And of course, when you're buying a battery, it's very important that you need to know uh, the year, make and model at yung laki ng makina nyo. So basically, when you go to the shop, what they would ask you is yung serial number ng sasakyan slash bin number uh, para ma-identify ng shop specifically kung anong klaseng baterya uh, that will be uh, that will be ano, uh, called by your manufacturer. So, so CCA is right here. So this one's kind of backward for you. So CCA, you see the CA and the CCA on this one? So the CCA is what we go by here in the cold climate in Manitoba. Yeah. So 550 would be uh, the power of your battery in order to crank or mm -hmm. start your engine, right? Mm -hmm. um, for the period of 30 seconds mm -hmm. um, um, at uh, minus uh, 18 and below. So mean, meaning na pakalamig nun, minus 18 and below. So yun ang power ng battery mo na may may provide niya. Uh, yung current niya na may provide niya para paikutin yung makina niya meaning para paanda rin yung na makina niya na, na hindi siya mahihirapan especially pag negative 30 no? that's correct yeah. especially here in Manitoba that's right and the whole reason why every old chains of PJ's Automotive we do check your battery mm -hmm. napaka importante po nun uh, uh, the reason why being is because in the cold weather right now this one we're gonna measure the battery and if it says this one is basically uh, the battery tester para ma-measure namin yung kapasitans ng cell mo sa loob ng baterya mm. in order to keep the charge or to provide the power para paanda rin yung makina nyo. This is what we use. So it will tell us kung makakapasa ba yung uh, battery, mo, battery mo sa kapasitans test. So what we're gonna do is right here, very very simple this technology is really good so very very simple so what we do is we just hook up our battery tester there and uh, yeah and what we gotta do is black to negative red to positive okay so here the battery will ask you this is this is your uh, battery uh, voltage right now. So static, we call them static voltage at 12.52, which is good, that's what you want. Mm -hmm. So now we just follow the prompt. So this is a regular flooded battery because he, uh, he has an acid in there, so, oh, which is liquid, so mm -hmm. that's why they call them regular flooded. Press one more button, yes, I'd like a regular flooded. Okay, so SAE, another term that they use for CCA is SAE, okay? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna pick the SAE, and then this one, the last, the last one that we tested, it was about 800 CCA, right? Mm -hmm. So yours, have a look at here. Yours is designated to 550. It's rated 550 CCA, mm -hmm. cold cranking amperage. So that's what we're gonna type in here. Okay. Yeah. That's correct. Kasi yun yung limit ng power ng battery mo. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna measure it at that uh, range. At that range. So did you say 550? So roughly around there, 550. And then we're gonna click OK. And once we click the OK, the, ba the battery tester will do the job. And it says here, good and pass. And if you notice right here on the right side of this tester, it shows 536. So meaning na itong baterya na to, will produce 536 CCA. Mm -hmm. So remember, it's not always gonna stay the same 550. That's the reason why we tested your battery, right? Mm -hmm. So, you know, day after day, of course, nawawala, you know, nababawasan yung power ng battery mo. Mm -hmm. And that's the whole reason why na kailangan natin tulungan ng baterya, pag malamig na malamig, ipa-plug natin siya. Yes. Oh. Para hindi mo na pupwersa yung whole power ng baterya pag pinapaandar tong makina na to sa napakalamig na panahon at uh, ano, yung mga tinatawag na minus 30, minus 40, we always plug that in. The reason why, kasi we don't wanna, ano, we don't wanna mag, uh, na mabawasan or uh, uh, you know, um, pahinain yung cell ng baterya sa loob. So, 
Anong range na temperature dapat isaksakang sasakyan? I would say with a good battery, just like yours, this is a good battery. It says yeah. good and pass. Yours is still rated 536 CCA, right? The battery is rated 550, but the actual measurement is 536 now. Yes. It's still good. It's still good and pass. So in your case, your battery, I would say plug it in in about minus 25. Minus 25. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Okay. So minus 25 and below, anything minus 25 and below, then you plug it in. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Okay. And this is the whole reason why we, we catch you my problem. Now, mm -hmm. here's the catch. Minsan, Minsan, your battery will tell you that no good and replace, right? Mm -hmm. And then your CCA will be like half of what is 550 rated for. So, ang mga yari nun, sa summertime is perfectly fine kasi hindi persado yung baterya na paanda rin yung makina. Right. But once you get to about minus 25 and minus 30, you better make sure that you change your battery because if you don't, that's where that's where the problem <laughs> occurs. Pag lumamig na nang lumamig. That's right. The symptoms will not be there during the summertime but will be there when the minus 25 kicks in. So, okay. okay. Salamat po. Salamat. Okay, TJ, uh, saan ka pwedeng kontakin nila? Halimbawa, meron silang mga ipapagawang mga sasakyan. Mm -hmm. Where do we contact you? Ay, mapakarami pong ways na we can uh, reach out to us. Ano? Uh, yung telephone, for sure. Yung cell phone ko is always with me. 720-5541. Once again, 204 720-5541. Ito uh, po yung, um, yung cell phone call. So you can text me on that number. You can call me on that number. I prefer text. Uh, in that way, uh, if I need to call you back, then uh, I'll call you back. But please make sure na mention yung pangalan nyo doon uh, as well as uh, yung number nyo that I can contact you back. Uh, also, we got Facebook page as well where you can contact us. So you can always uh, message us on Facebook. Uh, you know, tag us on Facebook. Uh, you can find us on Facebook, PJ's Automotive Service. Uh, yeah, so many ways to contact us. So, so shout out sa mga taga Nipawa. Oh, sa shout out po pala sa mga kaibigan natin dyan, kababay natin sa Nipawa, uh, si Dante Villanueva. Uh, shout out to you, my friend. Uh, Monje TV. Uh, hopefully, I pronounced that right. Monje TV. Si Charlie Visaya. Uh, si Hernan Kamana. Uh, si Duque, Duque Naive, Dulce, uh, Dulce, okay. Dulce Naive, and sorry, and si Milton Cristobal, Cristobal, uh, maraming salamat po sa inyo, hopefully uh, you can tag uh, this uh, video uh, for your next uh, video, so that would be great. Okay, thank you uh, Maraming again. salamat po, maraming salamat. Yeah, salamat, Eric. Okay.